So fans, welcome to the Media Motivator. Welcome to the Crypto Space. In this short video, I will be showing you how to link your Tafa Neurobot to Binance in very few steps. So if you are not having an account with Tafa Neurobot, which is one of the best cryptocurrency trading bots, make sure you visit the description of this video, create an account, click on that same description, join the WhatsApp group link, and then watch this video right up to the end for you to get real idea on how to link the bot and the Binance app. As you can see, this is the home page of the app. This is the most updated uh, version of the home page. At the time I'm making this video, it might change in the course of time. So once you're on this page, now you move over back to Binance. Let's take, let me take you to Binance app. This is my Binance app. All right, you go to Binance, log into your Binance app, and on the home page of Binance, you have something of this nature. While on this home page, click on more. Click on more. All right. Once you click on more, you'll be taken to this page. Scroll down, keep scrolling until you get to orders. Now, when you are at the level of orders, move over to API management. So you click on it. Once you click on API management, you'll be taken to this page. It might take a few seconds, depending on your network. All right, it is loading. All right, you'll be taken to this page. While on this page, click on create API. So you click on it. Once you click on it, uh, you have the following options. By default, you have system generated, system generated, and you have self generated. System generated is already selected, so you are choosing the API key type. So the first one is the best. Now click on next. Once you click on next, you'll be taken to this page. While on this page, simply enter the name of the API. So in this case, I'll enter Tafabot. Tafabot, that's the name I would like to call the API. Remember, you can create so many APIs. So at this level, I'll click on next. Once you click on next, you'll be taken to this page. This page is what we call the security verification requirement. So in my case, in this tutorial account, I have just the email verification and phone number verification. Uh, others, you might have the third option here, the Google Authenticate uh, Thor for those that have enabled that. So at this level, I'll click on a phone number and a code will be sent into the phone number I used in creating this uh, test account. So I'll click on it. The code has been sent. I'll go to that particular phone and I'll copy the code immediately. I'll copy the code. Oh, I hope the code. All right, sorry, at this level, I have to click on get code. All right, the code will be sent. Okay, the code has been sent. So I'm going to type the code here. It's an OTP, it's one time code. So I'm free to copy it here. All right, sorry, the code is poorly entered. A double seven, a double seven, uh, two, four. Six one. All right. Now I'm going to click now on emailed. Another code will be sent to my email address. All right. It's also an OTP. It's a one time code. So I have no fear exposing it to anybody. Of course, this is just a tutorial account. So I'll go over and I'll copy that code from my email. And this is the code. I'm entering the code here. It's 28551. All right. I'm done with the security verification. So at this level, I'll move over to the Tafa board application. And I'll click on top right where you have these three horizontal lines. I'll click on it immediately and then I'll move over to 
where we have connect and exchange so I'll click on it and then I'll have a series of exchanges so the main objective here is to connect the Binance exchange so I'll click on here I'll click on this once I click there I will have this I will have the API key the secret key and then right up there I have uh, the IP whitelist and instruction so I'll click on it and then I'll copy it has been copied I'll move back to Binance while on this Binance section I'll go over to where we have edit edit I'll click on edit here go to see it well I'll click on edit and then I scroll down I click on this small arrow here once I click on that small arrow I scroll again and I'll keep scrolling until I meet this section here where we have restrict access to trusted IPs only recommended so I'll click I'll select that button and then there will be a small space below please follow very carefully I'll enter the code I copied from the Tafabot account and then I'll click on confirm once I click on confirm I'll move over here up here I'll click on enable spot I'll click on enabled uh, futures I'll click on permit universal transfer all right those are the three things I have to enable there and then I'll move up here and I'll click on save all right I'll click on save good it is saving I'll be taken back to this page again to confirm all right so I'm going to confirm all right I've done for email already let me do now for phone number I'll click on phone and a code will be sent to the phone number I'll click on get code I'll wait for the code in that phone number the code has been sent and I'll copy the code it's a one-time code uh, all right 25 all right so at this level I have done the linking successful edit API success so I will quickly make sure I copy these two these two quotes here this API key and the secret key I'll copy them quickly I'll copy and I'll paste it elsewhere I'll probably take it to my uh, let's see I'll take it to all right I'll take it to to my whatsapp you can paste it everywhere anywhere make sure you copy and paste it carefully somewhere and then I'll go back all right the reason why I'm copying it as such is to avoid this page closing there are times it closes there are times it closes so I've put them in this order all right first one first so at this level I'll move back to the tougher board the tougher board uh, application as you can see I'm in the tougher board application all right so I'll enter those two codes I copied so the last one I paste and then I'll go and copy back the second one uh, the first one of course I'll copy it I'll paste all right sorry all right I paste and then I'll click on this arrow I'll click on this small arrow okay and I think that is all you have to do it is searching an exchange is connected so that is all you can see here so at this level all I need to do is to fund my Binance account and then I pay for the uh, license fee and the gas fee or the fuel fee that is virtually all if you are new to this channel please endeavor to subscribe like and share this video thanks and bye see you soon